looking for their sports channel guy. Welcome back, guys, to another NFL talk show video. And today, we have free agency frenzy. So, yeah, we're back for NFL talk show. It's been two months since I, last time I did NFL talk show. I've been doing a lot of Call of Duty. <laughs> so, yeah, we have all free agency, some trades in here. And we're going to tell you guys who's going to be the most, like, the best team in free agency. So, yeah, here we go. Ooh. Ooh, turn wrong way. So, for our first news, we have Kyle Long going to the Chiefs. Yeah, he's a retired player. And now he's back. We have um, Hassan Reddick. Um, yeah, he's a pass rusher. He he was a former Cardinal, but now now he's a Panther. So good for the Panthers. AJ Green signing with the um, Cardinals. Decent move, but don't don't really like it though. Now we also have um, Jamal Williams um, signing with the Lions. He used to be a Packer. So a number, great number two running back. We have William Jackson signing with the Washington football team. Great sign by the football team. Emmanuel Sanders signing with the Buffalo Bills. Don't really care for this move at all. Jacoby Brissett signing with the Dolphins for backup quarterback. So mm. Andy Dalton signing with the Bears. <laughs> This was terrible. He's going to be the starter. Okay. We have Teron Taylor signing with the Texans for a backup quarterback or maybe starter. Leonard Williams re-signing with the Giants. So pretty good for the Giants. Ryan Fitzmagic signing with the football team. Great sign. Jameis Winston signing with the um, Saints again. There's going to be a battle in the bayou. The Titans signing D Bud Dupree. Mm, won't do well. We have Corey Davis, Cor Corey Davis signing with the Jets. Good slot receiver. J.J. Watt signing with the Cardinals. Great move by the Cardinals. We also have Adoree Jackson signing with the Giants. Another great move. Mike, Michael Hid Hilton. No, it's Mike Hilton. We have, um, he's going to the Bengals. So, decent move for them. Um, Trey Henderson signing with the Bengals. Okay, good for their defense. Now, we also have, um, what, wait. I messed up, wait. Let me find it. Jeremiah Owuzie, corner from the now he's a Bengal, so he was a former Dow, Dow, um Cowboy. Now we have Gronk signing, re-signing with the Bucks, so pretty good move for the Bucks. Nelson Aguilar signing back, signing with the Patriots, great deep set, deep threat receiver. Yannick Nakwe, re-signing with, now signing with. The Raiders. So great pass rusher for the Raiders now. John Johnson, strong safety, former Ram, now signing with the Cleveland Browns. Joe Tooney signing with the Chiefs. So you have two new right guards. Guards. Now we have Matt Matthew Judon signing with the Patriots. Great pass rusher. Um John o. Smith. And Hunter Henry, both tight ends, signing with the Patriots. We have Levante David, re-signing with the Bucks, And Drew Brees, retired. We have Julian, Julian Edelman, re-signing. And we also have um, Alex Smith, retiring. So, And we also have um, Jordan Reed, retiring. So, happy retirement for them. We have another trade. Lee Smith, now a, now a Falcon tight end. Now the Buffalo Bills get a 7th round pick for this year. So, decent move. Now we also have 
Clowney signing with the Browns. Good pass rush for them. Then we also have a Dory. We already said George Jackson. Um, we have James Conner signing with the Cardinals. Probably won't do well there. Sam Darnold getting traded to the Panthers for a um, a six round pick this year. Next year, a second round pick, and a next year a fourth round pick. So good, they won't be drafting quarterback most likely. So they're going to get an offense tackle to protect their quarterback. Now we have trade for the draft. So the Dolphins traded their pick to the 49ers. So the 49ers have their third pick. So now they now the Dolphins have the 12, but they traded 12 for the Eagles six round pick. So the, the six six pick. So the Eagles now have the 12. The Dolphins have six. And then 49ers have the third. Leonard Fournette re-signing with the Bucks. Pretty good running back for them. We have Malcolm Butler signing with the Cardinals. And fun fact, he got the interception in the Super Bowl at the same stadium as the Cardinals play. So that's pretty cool. We also have T.Y. Hilton re-signing with the Colts. Kind of kind of knew that already because, yeah, they need a receiver. And also, Philip Rivers retired. Yeah. We have Eagles signing Joe Flacco. Good second quarterback for the Eagles because, yeah, they need a quarterback. Like a second string. Deshaun Jackson signing with the LA Rams. Pretty good signing. We also have Patrick Peterson signing with the Vikings. And we, he will be number seven because he paid money to change his jersey to number seven. So we have the Broncos signing Kyle Fuller, a corner. So good move by them. And the, the Bears released them. Kenny Galladay. Reese now signing with the Giants. Good move by the Giants because he's a deep threat receiver. Philip Lindsay, a running back, now signing with the Texans. Pretty good move because they need a, they need a running back. Because they cut um Duke Johnson. Um we have Chris Carson Reese now resigning with the Seahawks. Pretty good move. We have Juju Smith Schuster re-signing with the Pittsburgh Steelers. Great move because we need him back. Um, Justin Simmons signing, um, re-signing with the Broncos for another franchise tag. Yeah, pretty good. And then we have um, Will Fuller now will be a Dolphin. So another good weapon for them. Now we also have um, Chris Godwin re-signing with the Bucks. So pretty good move. Um, not a lot of offense alignment, I would like to say, but we forgot a trade. Orlando Brown got traded to the Chiefs, so another offense alignment for the Chiefs. And it's, so the Ravens get a first-round pick this year, so they have two picks this year, and like a lot next year. So, pretty good for the um Chiefs and Ravens. So, the Top three best teams that hit well in free agency are the Bengals. They have Mike Hilton, Trey Henderson, and they also have um, Ouzie and other players they picked up. Pretty good. Um, You have the Patriots signing all those players. Pretty good. Um, And then the third thing is that the Washington football team. It might be a little bit surprising. I didn't say the like the Browns because like yeah football team is going to be good next year they're going to win the division so yeah and here is some other news I forgot to say um Curtis Samuel is now a Washington football team player and we also have um what I just had in my head um I forget but like, yeah, a lot of good free agent, free agency moves this off season. 
So, and also the Giants are up there in my list because they do hit well. They all oh, it was John Ross. Yeah, good good pickup for the Giants. Um so watch the football team in the Giants this season. So guys, thank you for watching Big Stink Jake 56 free agency frenzy and guys look right here. I'm kind of upset because most of the people that watch me are not subscribed. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It's really easy. It takes two clicks. Sign into your email. Type that all that information in. And then go to my channel and hit the red button. Like, boom, boom, hit it. So you better, guys, you better do that. Just tell me. Exactly.